Alright guys, what's up? So, today I'm going to be talking about how to slappy grind. That's like whenever you just don't pop, you just kind of ride your skateboard into a curb or a parking bar curb. So, right here I'm going to talk about how to do slappy back 50, slappy back crook, and slappy back feeble. So let's get started with the slappy back 50. For this trick, honestly, Please at least know how to do these tricks like on the simple things like a flat bar or the box. And if you don't, I have trick tips in a playlist. You should check it out. At the end of the video, it'll be right there where you could click on it. So, here goes. For the slappy back 50, what you want to do is kind of go against the, the curb. I know that sounds weird. How are you going to go on it without popping? Simple. Be weightless. A lot of skateboarding tricks that are fun are required to be weightless that means you kind of just have to go at it like, like bam like you know hit it but you literally have to be weightless so this one you just go at it like however you're gonna you feel comfortable for a back 50 however you feel comfortable going at it just go at it be weightless that, and then you'll seriously just get on you literally just go and you'll just get on there R ride your board go slow at it first go and then eventually once you still get like, once you're getting comfortable, but also you want to make sure that it's waxed. If the if this parking block curb isn't waxed or if this uh, curb isn't waxed, get some wax, wax it up as much as possible so it makes your learning experience that much easier. Also there's another type of, you know, like the colored ones, the ones that are colored, like you see these parking, parking curbs, they're red, green, blue, white, yellow. Those are the best ones to actually go and skate. That way you don't have to like wax it because it's painted and that paint allows you to grind on it. So you might want to check those kind of spots out with this one for slappy grind though. So go at it, be weightless and just stay on top of it. It's like riding on a quarter pipe. If you know how to do back 50 grind, it's kind of like that but on this and then you just keep keep going at it I, there isn't really much of a trick tip for a back 50 one you just go at it as much as possible now for a slappy back feeble this one is so much easier in a way to get in getting out is probably the hardest part make sure that you dig up the area if you're doing a slappy grind like a slappy back feeble make sure you dig up the area so your wheels don't get caught up but if it's just a parking block curb it makes it easier because there's nothing on the other side so for this one you go at it, you lift up like if you're going to do a manual, but kind of go tilt sideways. So when you're going at it, tilt sideways and just get in there like that. That's literally it. You've seen that movement? I didn't even do nothing right here with. This is literally what you're going to do with your feet. You're going to stand up. You're, well, you're of course you're standing up, but you're going to go at it, lift your tail up, I mean your nose up, turn sideways, and that's literally what's going to happen. And that's slappy feeble. And then to get out, you're just gonna have to learn that pop out motion if, if it's a curb like this that doesn't end. If it's just like ending, it, it should be easy. But yeah, th that's how you do slappy feeble. You go straight, tilt sideways, and you get in. Now slappy crook, this one is different. I swear, you have to have your feet like this. For me, well at least I do. You put your feet like this, both, both of them. Because when you're hitting it, you just, hit it like that did you see that movement you literally go at it with your nose you lift up a little you just go like that with all fours you do that you just hit it like that but once you get in there put all your pressure down on your nose because it's gonna allow it to grind this way and then from there you just pop out so that you just go straight at it like if you're gonna freaking I don't know just go straight at the curb Go straight at it, hit it with all fours, tilted, just tilt that right there. Go in, put all your pressure, and then just get out. And that's it. Hopefully you guys understood what I was talking about with the slappy grinds. This is such a fun trick. I know I say that about a few that I've been posting lately, but seriously, this one is really fun. 
I enjoy doing this. It's simple, it's easy, it's not stressful. It's such a fun trick. It's one of the tricks that makes skateboarding fun. So if you have time, learn it. Spend a day or an hour on it. Thank you guys for watching. Leave a comment with the next trick you guys want me to do, and I'll do it. Like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next trick tip. Sayonara till the next one.